New 50 megabits per second internet and security edge customers only. Requires enrollment in EcoBill and AutoPay. Equipment, taxes, and fees extra and subject to change. Comcast Business Mobile utilizes the network with the most fruit metrics 5G data reliability wins in 1H 2022. Results may vary, not an endorsement. Do you have three ex-wives and your current trophy wife wants a life insurance policy three times the size of the policies you had to purchase for your previous mistakes? If so, you need to call Big Lou at Term Provider, 800-200-1966. Big Lou is intimately familiar with your problems, and if you're 50 or 60 years old and in reasonably good health, a $1 million dollar policy should only cost about a hundred to two hundred dollars per month. Big Lou may have a solution for your previous policies as well. You may even save enough money to lighten the load on your new one million dollar policy. Remember, call Big Lou. He's like you, except he's only on number two. Call Term Provider at 800-200-1966. That's 800-200-1966. For a million dollars in term life insurance that you can live with, call Big Lou at 800-200-1966. 800-200-1966. Anywhere fans go to cheer on their team, there are behind-the-scenes MVPs, ensuring everything is game day ready. We see you, Joe, fixing seats so every fan can enjoy every game. And Allie, who keeps her stadium running smoothly from the moment the first game starts to the last play of the season. At Granger, you're our MVPs, and we're always here for you with supplies and solutions for every industry and 24-7 customer support. Call, click Granger.com or just stop by. Granger for the ones who get it done. Without the ones like you, who work tirelessly to keep things running, everything would suddenly stop. Hospitals, factories, schools, and power plants, they all depend on you. No matter the weather, emergency, or time of day, you're the ones who get it done. At Granger, we're here for you 24-7 with supplies and solutions for every industry and access to product specialists ready to help. Call, click Granger.com or just stop by. Granger for the ones who get it done. When Big Mobile charges you an arm and a leg, they're taking your money and your power. And your arm and leg. Boost Mobile gives your power back with an unlimited plan for $25 a month on one of America's largest 5G networks. We can't give you back your arm and your leg because we're not qualified surgeons. Unless you're an iguana who can grow limbs back. Switch to Boost and get an unlimited plan for $25 a month. Boost Mobile. Unleash your power. New customers only. One line, $25 per month with auto pay. Additional restrictions apply. See BoostMobile.com for details. In Fremont, mostly sunny, a little cooler. Highs near 73. Weather. Brought to you by One Thing. Improve your gas mileage by properly inflating tires and taking your car in for a tune-up. Join Odyssey. And together, each of us doing one thing makes a greener tomorrow. It's time to wake up with a nice cup of morning roast. Featuring the Fillmore's finest, Monte Hill. <laughs> the pride of the Excelsior, Joe Butcher Boy Shasky. You're listening to 95 the game, the morning roast. The ogre formation with Nick Wilson as an extra offensive lineman. Christian McCaffrey. He's gone. There he goes. Christian McCaffrey through the line. He'll take it to the house. 90 yards. Touchdown, Stanford. Wide ass. Play clock down to two seconds. Hogan fires over the middle. It's McCaffrey in the open field. Christian McCaffrey still winding his way down inside the 10. He is as good as advertised. The plan for Stanford is to use multiple tight ends. In practice, they use them all week long here in preparation. Hogan to the middle, and it's complete. McCaffrey! Will he score on the first play from scrimmage? Yes! A lightning bolt. Oh! Baby! 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 It has happened last night at 8, what was it, 8.52 p.m. West Coast time. Christian McCaffrey, the boy that did wonders at Stanford University just down the road. And Paulo Alto, you heard all those highlights. 90-yard touchdown run against Cal. Big-time play against USC to flip the game at the Pac-12 championship. They had Levi Stadium rocking. The 75-yard play to start the Rose Bowl off against Iowa, where he goes over 400 total yards. Christian McCaffrey is a San Francisco 49er, and today's show has been hijacked with this move 
This is a big time move, a Super Bowl type move. We're going to get into it. Good morning to everybody out there. YouTube is fired up. Twitch is fired up. Xfinity Mobile text lines fired up. People on the roadways even know how to drive this morning. They're driving 90 miles an hour thinking about Christian McCaffrey all over the place. And then I got Joe Shasky and Patrick Willis jersey. I got Matson fired up. Lopman's running around with his neck cut off. Joe Shasky, CMC. It's wearing red and gold, and it may happen this Sunday against the Kansas City Chiefs. I'm so happy. I mean, look, sports makes us so happy. Like, these types of moments, all right? This is, on so many layers, this is such a great deal, right? Like, I, I oh, the draft picks, oh, the money. Shut up. This is Christian McCaffrey. This is one of the top 10 or 15 offensive weapons in the league. Quarterbacks notwithstanding. Wouldn't you agree, B? Had the Rams got this guy? Had the uh, uh, Bills the gotten this Bills. guy? Had the Green Bay Packers the gotten Chiefs. this guy? Any one of those teams, you would go, oh, my God. Are you kidding me? Like, this guy's a Swiss Army knife. Is he a running back? No. Is he a wide receiver? No. He's a ridiculous. Ridiculous football player. And you can line him up anywhere. And yes, yes, Shanahan's going to have to do that. That's the challenge is to go out there and, and you got to get the ball to all of these playmakers. This makes Jimmy Garoppolo better. This makes George Kittle better. This makes Brandon Ayuk better. This makes Debo Samuel better because scheme is about space. And no team is more built on creating space than the San Francisco 49ers. B, I'm going to go back in time for you just for a second. 1981. There was a move that was made. That people to this day, if you Google it and try to look for it, you can't even find you know the move. what the compensation was. Fred Dean, to the Chargers to the Niners. They were three and two. They were struggling a little. They were in between two different schemes. And they made a move for a veteran player who was devalued and in a contract dispute with his current team, the San Diego Chargers. And now they bring Fred Dean in. Has anyone... In the 40 years since Fred Dean came to the Niners, said, oh, but the draft picks, oh, but the money, that's loser talk. I want to win a Super Bowl now. I've been waiting since 1995 to celebrate my team. We got grown-ass men like Kyle Madsen back here who's been watching this team his whole life and has watched every other team in this league go all in and put their chips in the middle. We've been saving and saving and we've been prudent and we've been paying our own superstars forever. Guess what? Daddy needs a new kitchen, and this guy is the best damn oven because he's cooking in the NFC. A couple weeks ago. I'm so fired up. A couple weeks ago. It's going to be a long show. Dude, because we got, Cause I, got a lot, I, I, I have a lot of receipts. We got CMC. We got a lot of receipts. This is a couple times. The week of the Carolina game, nobody was talking about this. And Lubbin and I, and, and I'm going to play this cut. This is between you and I. This is, a couple, this is a couple days, I believe, after the Carolina game. Listen to this convo between you and I. Rounders Listen, I, I, I do it all day. I do it all day because this is players. a year. This is a year, and I told you this, Shasky. This is a year at the NFC. The Rams got their Super Bowl. Yes. They got their Lombardi. The Niners have been so close to getting that Lombardi. I feel like this is the season. If we're going to go all in at the deadline, with all the injuries that's piling up, this is the season to go all in. I love the team now. I think they could play deep into gen in January with the team as is. With Jimmy trending up and Jimmy looking good. But if you could just add another weapon or two. Oh, my gosh. Uh, but this, this thing is attainable, man. Well, th that's one of the things you want to see Debo play a little more wide receiver. Right. If you get somebody like CMC out there, think of the formation diversity that's, you can do. That's what I'm saying. I mean, you imagine a three-by-one formation with Debo, Kirsten McCaffrey, George Kittle, and then Ayuk on the other side? I, I, I'm <laughs> sitting there watching him, and you know what I'm thinking to myself? The NFL needs him out of there. He would be one of the most marketable stars yep. in the NFL if he played on a premier team. You know what? How many days ago was that? And that was about 10. And I've got another cut. <laughs> I've got another cut that was 14 days ago. So, you know, last night we were popping our stuff. We were flexing. We were flexing. Because a lot of people said, you know, these two hot take guys from 6 to 9 a.m. on the morning rolls was just bringing up, just throwing stuff against the wall. Christian McCaffrey. Oh, they're just throwing stuff against the wall. It's going to be too expensive. It's going to be too expensive. All the draft picks, draft picks, and draft picks. How many draft picks have not panned out? Oh, so many. How many draft picks Bonte, have not panned out Bonte, for this football team? I'm watching a third-round pick this year play fullback for one snap last last week. I'm watching a fourth-rounder that you cut last year. He's playing for the Philadelphia Eagles. Right. I'm watching your second-rounder that you drafted catch a touchdown pass to beat you on his third team, Dante Pettis. All right, Jalen Hurd, Dante Pettis, Trey Sermon. Joe Williams, they tried to pay Okello for Jerick McKinnon. They tried to pay for Jerick McKinnon. It did not work out. So what do you do? The Niners, this is what they did last night. They traded a second-round pick in the 2023 NFL draft. 
They traded a third round pick in the 2023 NFL draft. They traded a fourth round pick in the 2023 NFL draft. Then they traded a fifth rounder in the 2024 NFL draft. Now I was looking at Niners Wire. Shout out Kyle Batch and Niners Wire. And I'm looking at the updated look at the 2023 draft picks. So this is after what, they've made the trade. After they made the trade. They still have two third round compensatory picks. You still got a fifth rounder, and you may get two more compensatory compensatory picks in the fifth round and the seventh round. Then you got a seventh rounder and another seventh rounder. So the picks are still there. And I think, look, with a move like this and the salary cap exploding next season and the year after, there could be some guys on the move. Eric Armstead may be on the move. Well, Kill fix- may be on the move. I'll worry about the picks exactly. when we get that April. Look, I, I do not care. Shasky. I'll fix this their is cap about, situation yeah, in five this moves. Is, this is why Parate gets paid the big Thank bucks. you. And when you Thank make a move you. like this, scare money don't make money. The Cowboys are trying to make moves. The Rams are still trying to make moves with no offensive line. You go bring in a Christian McCaffrey, a guy who's a dual threat, and you get him and Debo on the backfield together. And those plays that we, those clips that we just yeah. played coming into the show. You know two of those highlights? Huh. Guess what routes th- those were? What? Those were the Texas routes uh, out of the shotgun my, formation. My only favorite route in, in football. How many times have we seen Shanahan run a Texas route with Jeff Wilson Jr., yep. Debo Samuel, yep. Matt Breida? Yep. Now he gets to run it with Christian McCaffrey? Are you kidding me? Ponte, even if you kept the picks, just for a second, if you kept the picks, you know what you would be praying? That any one of those picks turned into half the player Christian McCaffrey yep. is. Yep. That's what you'd be praying. That's what you'd be praying I mean, you'd for. You'd be praying for that. And look, you traded a second round pick for Jimmy Garoppolo. Yep. That worked out for you. You traded a second round pick for like 300 snaps of, of D Ford. And you know what? People could say, oh, well, D Ford was hurt. That worked out for you. Was it worth it going to the Super Bowl that year? Yep. Yep. 100%. I do that trade all, all day. day long. How about when you traded a third and a fifth for Emmanuel Sanders? Uh, it worked out. How about that third and fifth or third and fourth, excuse me, that you traded for Trent Williams? Has that worked uh, out? Oh, it's worked out. Exactly. Big time. All right, look, I know everybody wants to, to hoard draft picks. They've been hoarding draft picks my whole life. Right. All right? I love that they put their chips in the middle. And here's where I want to say I am proud to be a 49er fan today. Y- yes. There's layers to this. Kyle Shanahan, it's a gutsy, ballsy move. You know and what? I'm here for it. You know what? John Lynch, Hell yeah. Kyle Shanahan deserve a ton of credit. They deserve a ton of credit. And you know what? John Lynch and Shanahan, I was thinking about it last night, and I was like, man, this is their boldest move ever. But you know what? They made bold moves. That's what I'm saying. They made bold moves. Jimmy G and was started, a bold move. Jimmy Garoppolo for a second round pick was a bold move. Exactly. Moving up in the draft to get Trey Lance was a bold move. Getting uh, a minute who was a bold move. Trading for D Ford, a second round pick for D Ford and paying him was a bold move. Did it work out? No, it didn't. But they make bold moves. And when you look at the landscape in the NFC, oh, and I guarantee you this, game and changer. I guarantee you this, we got the gonna, best we're, offensive listen, personnel in the and, NFC. And listen to this. I'm watching that Arizona game, right? I got the Chiefs Bills on because yeah. I was ready to come in today and say the Niners are beating the Kansas City Chiefs. <laughs> now okay. I have no doubt in my mind the Niners are winning on Sunday. They are winning on Sunday. Okay. I'm speaking that into existence. You know I don't guarantee stuff. When I do, it comes through. I'm guaranteeing a win on Sunday, damn it, in the throwbacks. Okay. But second, I'm watching Arizona. <laughs> I love you. And the Saints. I'm watching the Arizona and the Saints. In their black helmets? In the black helmets. Okay. Actually, you know what? I warned up. So now you're on my side. Because DeAndre Hopkins is out there with the dreadlocks flowing behind the helmet. And I'll guarantee you, John Lynch, Kyle Shanahan, and that Niners brass was sitting there watching that Thursday night football game on Amazon Prime saying, look at the juice Hopkins has given Arizona. Arizona had won the home game in over a year. Let's see, you know, they dropped 45 points on the Saints. Now, they were aided by two pick sixes, but Hopkins goes out there with 10 catches for 100 yards, and it's like, Oh, they got some juice now. And they made the trade for Robbie Anderson a couple days before that. So I guarantee you, Lynch and company and Shanahan said, damn, they just got to pop with Hopkins. We're going to have to see the Cardinals a couple times later in the season. One in Mexico City, yep. one at Levi Stadium. It's time to go get our juice. It's time to go get our lightning in a bottle. And it's time to go get Christian McCaffrey. And damn it, they got it done. And I can't. I couldn't be more proud to be a 49er fan. So I proud. couldn't be happier for Shanahan. I couldn't be happier for John Lynch. This is a and money wait, time move. Let's go to the top. Jed York, yeah. this is an Eddie D. Joe Lakeup, George mm-hmm. Steinbrenner kind of a move. Big time. And you know what? You deserve credit. I hope you're flaunting it today. <laughs> I hope you got the top down, windows up, money out the window. Let's go. And like I on want, the real. I want to on see Shanahan. Real. I want to see Shanahan smile from ear to ear today at his presser when he discusses his trade. I can't wait to hear John Lynch say, yeah, you know, this is a move we had to make. This is what the big boys Bean, do. Last year, they came down. It came down to a couple plays. Would you agree? <sighs> We're celebrating the team. Just for a second. 
We're celebrating a team 10 years ago. And this is my overarching theme with the Niners. My whole adult life, we've come up a little short. Yep. And we're always one player, one yep. play, two plays yep. away from winning it. We're celebrating mm -hmm. the core. Willis, Bowman, uh, Vernon Davis, Justin Smith, Alden, Cap, Alex. We all mm -hmm. agree, okay? I can mm -hmm. keep throwing the names out. Frankie G. We all agree. God damn it. If you look back, wouldn't it have been great if they would have just made that little trade to get a wide receiver? We knew just it in 2011. Won. We knew it. We knew it. They are one receiver short in 2011. Hey, Shasky, it felt like there were one receiver short for 15 straight years. <laughs> I know. But my going being, back to the T.O. days. But my point <laughs> being is like, we did all the trading. Then we were on the reverse side of this Carolina deal. We traded away Alex Smith. It turned into nothing. It was right. five picks that literally yeah. the number one guy was Carlos Hyde. Yeah. Okay? The Chiefs are doing that deal ten mm -hmm. times in a row before mm -hmm. we ever. It was Corey Lemonye, mm -hmm. some guard from Virginia that no one right. remembers named Monroe, right. who had a busted ACL. You trade for commodities that are proven. And I look at what happened last year. They were on the doorstep again of going back to the Super Bowl. And what was the difference? You could say Joe's Cooper Cup. It was also Odell Beckham. Right. It was also Vaughn Miller. Yeah. Two guys. Guys acquired yep. midseason yep. by the Rams. Yep. I'm not saying you got to mortgage mm. the future. They haven't mortgaged the future. Right. They've got pillars everywhere. Right. Look at the offense. You can make the argument they've got four, at minimum, top five guys at their position on offense. And, and, and look at this. On offense. The, on offense. And their core is locked up. They're going to lock up Nick Bosa. It's fine. They're fine. Devo Samuel just got locked up. Kittle's still under contract. Brett and I, you still on this rookie deal. You got players. Aaron Banks is in the second year. Burford's a rookie. I know. A rookie. Suppress salaries, Trent, too. Trent, exactly. Trent Williams is at left tackle. I know. You know what I'm saying? You can make your linebacker core and Drake Greenlaw and Frank Warner Jr. Guess what? They're locked up, too. They're locked up. I know. Ufanga's locked up. You just signed Mooney Ward. The time to win yep. is now, damn 100%. it. And this is a big-time move here. And I, I absolutely love the balls it took to make a move like this. The hell with the draft picks. The hell with the draft picks, especially when you've been whiffing on these picks. And the money, they will figure out the money. When you look at the money. C CMC, Christian McCaffrey. We're not talking about CMC yeah, Music yeah. Channel yeah. on Channel 26. We're although, talking about C-Mac. Although I did love that channel. Oh, I love Shout that channel Gomez. every day. Part Trace, of the Odyssey crew. Hey, hey Trace Dog and Francis, yeah, too, man. <laughs> Come on, man. Making $690,000 this year, Christian McCaffrey. Next year, 11.8. The year after, 11.8. The year after that, $12 million. Now, there's a player's option tied in there, but I got to guess Christian McCaffrey's going to love being back in the Bay Area. He's already tweeted out. You saw Drake Jackson tweeting. You saw Debo Samuel. Like, oh my gosh, you, it's real. The Drake Jackson response. So I got home. Huge win for the O Club last night to get Good ourselves time. into playoff position. Uh, come from behind. Super resilient. And Chuck Gartland, if you're out there listening, 1,000 fielding percentage at third base in his first mm -hmm. game at third base. And he needed a shout out. But I get home. I'm sitting down with my wife. You know when you put your phone on like no yeah, notifications yeah, oh yeah all the so time so i got it on the no <laughs> notification so that it doesn't buzz during dinner and we're supposed to put our phones away during dinner and we're sitting there and Don't we're say talking that too loudly because anna's been trying to do that well, that's all right. for a long we're, time. Having, we're having original joe's pizza boom 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 we're eating i'm having a little garlic knot i'm trying to have a little cheat night with my wife you know where i'm eating some carbs and she goes oh oh the niners made a trade I go, what she's telling me and she goes we got that guy McCaffrey, and she knows who McCaffrey is because she plays fantasy football. And I, like, run to my phone, and I flip it open. I had 90 missed messages. I go, you've got to be kidding me. You've got to be kidding And I had the same exact response as Drake Jackson. Christian McCaffrey to the Niners? So. Are you effing kidding me? So. Are you kidding me? <laughs> So, Let's go. So shout out to 483 people right now on YouTube right now. 622 in the morning. They're all fired What up. numbers he wearing? You, what jersey am I getting? I, I don't know. 22? Well, let me tell you how I found out. Huh. Because and, and we're going to get to the calls. This is going to be a caller-driven show. How happy are you? Is it too much? I'm proud to be a Niner too much? fan. Are you concerned Let's about go. the injury history with Christian McCaffrey? It's a thing. It's a thing. And we're going to address it today. It's not all peaches and cream. There's some cons to this move. But I had to shower right now. I just put baby chairs down. It was daddy-daughter night. Daddy daughter night. I put her down. Oh. Had a great bath. I actually talked to Lubman when she was in the bath. She was throwing soap on oh. me and stuff. We're having a great time. I put her down to bed. She's rubber knocked ducky, out. Not, you're she, the yeah, one. Oh, we got the rubber ducky. Yeah, we got it all. Yeah. So we got her in there, rub the belly, say bye bye, good night, Spicone Noche, I love you. I got the shower water running because we hit Russian? the pool. Yeah, that was Russian. Well, right over that my was head. Russian. Sorry. Right, sorry. I was like, what language <laughs> so, are you seeing? So, I'm all over. <laughs> Listen, I got the shower running. <laughs> Yati Balu Blue, which means I love you. Listen, I got the shower water running, right? Because uh -huh. we had hit the pool. I'm like, all right, I need to wash this chlorine yeah, off. It's yeah, been a yeah, while. Yeah, yeah. And as I'm going into the shower, because I'm going to breathe my phone in to watch the Lakers game in the shower, I get tagged in a tweet. 
and I'm looking at my Twitter, and I'm just like, all right. And you know who it's tagged like, me? What is it, the fake Adam Schefter? Like, we all thought, like, are, are, is that the real Adam Schefter? So, Marvin, who, whose at name on Twitter is uh, Bonte Hillstead. Oh. That's his at. Is that's it his Messi avatar. Marvin? Messi Marvin, at Bonte Hillstead. And he tags me in a tweet, and it says, Christian McCaffrey traded to the 49ers, Adam <laughs> Schefter. And I'm like... Oh, Hold on, man. And so I click on Adam Schefter, <laughs> Abby, and I'm like, is this a fake check Yeah, mark? no, you don't want to get fake. Yeah. <laughs> I retweeted it anyway. Yeah. And I was like, wait a minute. Oh, what did I do? Cause, I'll cause rescind like, later. It, like, for two minutes, nobody was tweeting anything about McCaffrey. I'm like, oh, I got duped. I got duped. And I look, and I was like, okay, 9.8 million followers. That can't be fake. Uh -huh. It's the check mark. And that's thing, you know, the text, the text messages just yeah, went on. And I was like... Oh my gosh. So the water ran without me getting in the shower for about 25 minutes. So I wasted all the water where I lived and then it finally got in the shower and it's like, they got Christian McCaffrey. So in our family league, okay, and no one cares about fantasy, but my grandfather, 86 years old, okay, 86 years old, he's won it two years in a row, okay? Who's his favorite player in the NFL? Christian McCaffrey. You know why? You know what he says? What? He reminds me of Hugh McElhaney. <laughs> I'm telling you the truth. I'm telling you the truth. Yeah. Because Hugh McElhaney is what McCaffrey was. Think Marshall Falk. Catch the ball out of the back. Yep. Think Roger Craig. This is the organization when it comes to Swiss Army knives and running backs, wide receivers, guys that are pass happy, that can do a lot of things on the field. This is that dude. This is a match made in heaven. Right. This is football porn. <laughs> you damn right. I said that that drought. We got Chris McCaffrey, Oscar Clyde, Kyle, Adam Gordon. We're going to get all to you. We're going to start the calls next segment here. It's a big day in 49er land. You should be proud to be a 49er fan. Chris McCaffrey is wearing red and gold. This is a Super Bowl type move. It's Super Bowl or bust. And you know what? I love it just like that. The Golden State Warriors right now are championship or bust. Joe Lake and the company, all they want to do is hang banners. It's about damn time the Niners get that philosophy and let's go. It's back to the 90s, baby. Super Bowl or bust. McCaffrey's a Niner. It's a big Speaking boy of the Warriors, move. Big it's a big boy, boy move. move. Speaking of the Warriors, tune in to Warriors Live on 95.7 Game, oh. presented by Xfinity. They got a big game tonight against Nuggets. I can't wait for that. I can't wait. The Bay Area's on fire right now. We are the sports capital of the world. Damn it. Supercharge your home with supersonic Wi-Fi, unbeatable, unbeatable internet, only from Xfinity. It's a battle of MVPs. The first unanimous selection in the entire history of the NBA. Steph Curry. It's my honor to announce that Nikola Jokic is this year's most valuable player. Steph Curry and the Warriors host Nikola Jokic and the Nuggets. Our pregame coverage starts tonight at 6. Only on 95.7. The game. Diabetes, high blood pressure, anxiety meds, everyone's on them. If you're a 50-year-old male, maybe a bit beefy, and you may even have type 2 diabetes, a million dollars of term insurance may only cost you about 200 bucks a month. Call Term Provider. Speak with Big Lou at 800-444-9336. Big Lou will find a term life policy for you even if you have type 2 diabetes or overweight or have high blood pressure. Term Provider has helped thousands of people like you who think they can't afford term life insurance. To buy a million dollars of affordable term life for you, all you need to do is call Big Lou at 800-444-9336. Lou will make sure the scales are tipped in your favor. Call 800 444-9336. Big Lou will answer your call and work to fit you into a term life policy that you can afford. Remember, Big Lou's like you. He's on meds too. For affordable term life, call 800-444-9336. If you own a business, this has been a bumpy ride. From pandemic to inflation, I'm sure you could use a break. If your business has five or more employees and survived COVID, you might be eligible to receive a payroll tax refund of up to $26,000 per employee. The challenge is getting your hands on it. Hi, I'm Howard Mackler, and that's why I founded GetRefunds.com to cut through the red tape and get you the money. The team of tax attorneys we have put together are highly trained in this little known own payroll tax refund program. We do all the work, charge not a dime up front, and simply share a percentage of the cash that we get for you. Businesses of all types can qualify, including those that took PPP, nonprofits, and even those that increases in sales. 
We have helped return over a billion dollars to businesses and we can help you too. Just go to GetRefunds.com slash sports, click on Qualify Me and answer a few questions. This payroll tax refund is only available for a limited period of time. Don't lose out on up to $26,000 per employee. Go to GetRefunds.com slash sports. That's GetRefunds.com slash sports. Are you interested in new career opportunities in the Bay Area and want to make a difference in your community? The SF Sheriff's Office is looking for people considering a job in law enforcement right now. If you're at least 20 years or older with a high school diploma or equivalent, the SF Sheriff's Office wants to hear from you. Enjoy full benefits, flexible schedules, and opportunities for growth and promotion. For employment announcements and more information, visit sfsheriff.com. That's sfsheriff.com to apply today. Big O Tires proudly sells its own brand of affordable tires, and each set comes standard with the nation's greatest warranty. Now through October 30th, save $100 instantly on select Big O brand tires with installation purchase. Visit your locally owned Big O Tire store for offer details. The Prophetic Matrix. Unlock the secret code to your destiny. A new revolutionary book by Michael John Toste. The first ebook to make history by being filmed in space. Discover your unlimited future. Get the Prophetic Matrix now on Amazon.com and BarnesandNoble.com. I'm Bob Burke, founder and chairman of Burke America Parts Group, a family of brands that includes RepairClinic.com, an appliance and HVAC parts solution company that's grown into an international brand. Before AmericanEagle.com, we partially launched a new technology platform developed by another firm. American Eagle helped take our technology to a whole new level with digital marketing, software development, and business insights into our key markets, appliances, HVAC, and outdoor power equipment, and did so both on time and on budget. AmericanEagle.com has the resources, experience, and talent needed to produce solutions. Our new technology platform developed by AmericanEagle.com has produced tremendous results with higher traffic, conversion, engagement, and online revenue. If you have any home repairs you need to take care of, check us out at RepairClinic.com. If you need a world-class website or technology project, then I would highly recommend AmericanEagle.com. Call AmericanEagle.com at 773-NETWORK. That's AmericanEagle.com, 773-NETWORK. Now, back to the Morning Roast with Vontae and Shasky. Oh, I'm so amped. I am so amped. This game just Ooh! went up levels. By the way, yesterday, I, I was already on that Chiefs hype. Will Lucy hit me up. My my dad, my brother, we're all going to the Chiefs game. Okay, right? So I'm getting tickets galore. We're all over the place. The cheapest ticket to get into this game for the Chiefs was like 200 bucks. That's the cheapest. I'm talking, that's like playoff level going prices. going up now? It's going up now. It's going Yesterday's up now. price is not today's price. It's going up now. And, and, and I already thought last night, I convinced myself that the Niners were winning that game. And then the trade happened. And then the trade happened. And then the trade happened. I'm so hyped. So, I, look, forget Sunday. Just, again, I'm going to keep the same energy. Just keep me the 4-4 four and four by the bye week. And I'll worry about the rest of the season. Because this team, with this defense... I don't care if they don't play a single home game in the playoffs. They can go to anywhere, anytime, and kick your ass with this team, with this defense, with this offensive personnel. All Jimmy has to do is drive the Porsche and don't scratch it. Don't scratch it. Park it nice hell. Here's a couple extra bucks to go get a valet parked. All right? Don't scratch it at all. You, this is He's got all the toys of the world. You got McCaffrey. You got Debo. And now the onus is also on Shanahan again. And Shanahan... I'm looking for him to just get real creative. Screenplays, Texas routes, three by one formations, you name it, trick plays. Hell, in that Pac 12 championship game against USC at Levi Stadium, which is probably the most dynamic Pac 12 championship uh -huh. at Levi Stadium. Do you know Chris McCaffrey actually threw for a touchdown pass in that game? The Hogan? They ran the Philly Special against USC before the Philly Special was a thing. This guy does it all. So now the playbook, when it comes to trick plays, creativity, screens, you want to put Debo and McCaffrey in the backfield? Go ahead. You want to put them both in the slot? Go ahead. Well, they got to do that. Like, like, like I'm, well, we're going to see it. Here, here's what I like uh, about the personnel fit for them. Like right now, forget Trey for next year or years beyond. We'll figure that out. For right now, give Jimmy G his flowers. On the underneath stuff, he is good. That That's part of his bread and butter, right? If you want to work the edges underneath... Who better, besides Alvin Kamara, name right. another guy who works the edges, and I would argue McCaffrey's better than, right. than Alvin Kamara. Kamara. But who works the edges better? 
Who has speed that this team has just well, been lacking since Mostert yes, left? And this is big time speed, and it's going to open up everything down the football field. I want to take some calls oh, here. So I take some calls. Let's get to Clyde in the city. Clyde, what's Clyde, up, baby? What's happening? You're on the roast. Let's go. Morning, guys. What's up, baby? I just want to say, and I hope Kyle Shanahan can finally get a good night's sleep or rest. <laughs> we can draw some even better plays. I can't wait to see the McCaffrey Debo in the backfield Wildcat. I can't wait. This dude's fourth in Russian on the gear. And I just want to add to say, uh, Joe, yeah. I know you're going to be at the game. Yep. Bonte, I hope you can cancel that Sacramento and make it to the game. <laughs> <laughs> I'll be at 327. Good. I'm super hyped up. And, and yeah. let me tell you this. Even if the kid doesn't play this weekend, I just feel like this team needed a jolt. They yeah, needed no a jolt to shake things up. No to see Drake Jackson's response, it we'll reminded me of a baseball trade where you, your team's grinding all year, and they just need that upper management to send them a little but, something to help, some reinforcements. You're talking about Terry Seals with the Niners. Let's talk about what the Padres did at the deadline to go get Josh Bell and Juan Soto. Oh, that was a jolt. Do you think they remember the prospects? No. They're in the NLCS tied at one game apiece against the Philadelphia Phillies. No. And Juan Soto had a huge hit yeah. in game two to wake his game up. Josh Bell has had a nice little postseason uh -huh. so far. You think they care about the prospects in San Diego? No. They make big boy moves. No. All right? They missed out on Scherzer the year before and Trey Turner. You think the Dodgers regret that trade? Hell no. Even, so even though Scherzer, Scherzer played there for three months, mm -hmm. they don't regret it. They don't regret it. This is what you do if you want to play at the big boy table. Bonte, you know what I could do? I could bore the audience and go through all of the draft picks over the last six years no, I don't that do they that. didn't hit. You, C.J. Beathard, we traded up for right. in the third round. TDP, right. uh, Trey Sermon. Joe Williams. A whole lot of nothing burgers. Joe Williams, Trent Taylor. I'm looking at the picks right now. Dante Pettis. You know, Tarverius Moore. Hasn't panned out too well. Jalen Hurd, third round pick. All right, 67 overall. I think I care about these picks for Christian McCaffrey. Let's go to Kyle and Pacifica. Kyle, what's happening? You're the roast. Hey, what's up, guys? I'm so fired up. Let's go. Hey, I'm I'm 25 years old. I've never. I'm starving for a championship. See, you know That's what I'm going to say. I want to get greedy. I want OBJ. Hey, I'm with you. Sign me up. You're preaching to the choir. Oh, hey. Yo. <laughs> You're preaching to the choir. You know what? You I think that that's... You don't got to convince me. That, that's a lot of people. Uh, Madsen, I know how you're 32, right, Madsen? You're 32, Kyle. Correct. Still got to. 32. And this guy's 25 who's on the phone right now. These guys have seen one run Listen. in the Shanahan era, essentially, this core. Another run with Harbaugh, and that's it. That's it. And they've been knocking on the door. We've been knocking on the door. And I already saw a generation. We are going to celebrate a generation of players that I felt deserved a Super Bowl for crying out loud. And I felt like they never truly went all in. All at once. It's like they were great and yep. they were right there. And look, I can live. If you fall short now, I can live with it. I can you know live with why? it too. Because you went all in yep. for the now. Yep. Let's do it. We've been yep. safe and we've been saving our money yeah, and we've been trying to buy a house. You own the house already. Now it's time to upgrade the kitchen. No, Let's yeah, go. Yeah, yeah, I love this move. I love this move. This is a big time move. We're going to get to the calls in just a second. But we have a new segment. A new little three minute shindig called Steve Kerr's Corner. Now, we're going to play a Steve Kerr highlight, a bit from Steve Kerr. We're going to respond to it, two sentences or less, okay. maybe like 15 seconds, and then we'll hit the break and get right back into Christian McCaffrey. Look, Joe Lacob and I, I, I guarantee you, Joe Lacob company have set the tone in the Bay Area. 100%. They set the tone. 100%. Paying the luxury tax bill, giving out the money, saying we want to raise banner after banner after banner after banner. And everybody else has been left in the dust. The Niners have been coming close. But you remember walking out of that NFC Championship game? For crying out loud, Rocco and I had to pick up Charles Haley Head. Way to pick him up. Ponte, I've been a 49er fan my entire life. This is one of the happiest days in 49er land in the last 25, 30 years. And I mean that. Like the optimism, you are getting a top, top tier apex right. predator look, running back. Look, and it's a good problem to done. have. I, I just want to keep listen, talking about listen, this. Listen, it's going to so be, it's gonna be a great problem. It's a great problem to have. And Steve Kerr. He has a problem, but it's because the Warriors are too deep. And you discuss trying to find minutes for this deep and loaded go-to state Warriors roster. It's time for Kerr's Corner. Presented by Xfinity. Supercharge your home with supersonic Wi-Fi. Unbeatable internet. Only from Xfinity. Here's Bonte Hill. All right, baby. Let's play the cut, Lawman. Let's play the cut. How are yeah, we've Steve? proven over the years um, with deep teams that we've been able to handle that. It's not easy. It's not easy for the players. 
you know, when, when everyone is healthy and you've got 12 guys, 13 guys who are all capable of playing minutes and who, have, and who probably deserve minutes and only 9 or 10 can play, that's hard on two or three players. And so what we just try to convince our players of is that over the course of 82, it always works out and it really does where everyone's going to get a chance. And, and the whole point is to, you know, to contribute to something special like we did last year. I think the same thing happened for us last year. You can go down the list, and every single guy really contributed at key moments, and um, and that's what we're looking for this year, too. All right, that was Steve Kerr, and look, he has a good problem on his hands, and we'll get that uh, Steve Kerr's corner cleaned up. Um, deep roster, they're loaded. Now Shanahan has a problem. He has to figure out how to get the ball to Debo, Ayuk, Kittle, and Christian McCaffrey. Shouldn't be too hard. Going to be a lot of one-on-one -on -one opportunities for those guys. And for the Golden State Warriors, got Wiseman coming off the bench. He's going to get some schooling from Jokic tonight. I can't wait to see that matchup. Kuminga against Aaron Gordon. You got Draymond, Clay, Steph. This is a good problem, Shasky, the Warriors have right now. It's like the 49ers. There's only one ball. Yeah, that's fine. And we're going <laughs> to spread it out to everybody. No, but I, I'm, I'm very excited for the Warriors tonight, obviously, against the Nuggets. And Kerr's right. They, they do almost have like a mini problem. But here's the beauty of it. With all the inventory of games that you and Mark Willard love, 82 of them, there's plenty of rest nights where yep. the young guys are going to get opportunity. So, yeah, I'm with them on that. I can't wait to get back into the Christian McCaffrey thing. Though. I'm not going to lie. Okay, my head is spinning. And, and listen, honest to God, nope. my overall arching thing, last night I couldn't even go to bed because and I know people, I'm yelling sports sports makes people so happy think of how united the bay area feels this morning around yep. their team think of how happy that golden state warrior team made you during the summer like all of this has got crap yep. going on in our lives there's so much negativity in this world that when something fun happens and your team well, goes all in freaking embrace it I really don't have time for the negative Nancy's oh well he gets hurt oh he cost draft picks you know what god damn it I've been waiting for my team to go all in and win a damn Super Bowl. You play the game and you root for your team to hang championship banners. Why do we celebrate the Warriors? Because they actually win championships. And you know what? The 49ers took a huge leap forward, and I'm all here for it. McCaffrey is balling this year. We'll get into the numbers. We'll get into the co draft pick compensation. We'll get into his injury history. Is it a good move for the 49ers? Who's not excited about it? Because I want to see, I want to hear from the other side. There's somebody out there who's not happy with the move. And you know what? It's okay. A legit. I get it. I understand it. The injury concerns are there. Played three games and seven games. He played 10 games in the last two seasons. Uh, and then this year, he's played every single game. But there's some concern there. Now he's on that grass, though, at Levi Stadium. Boy, this is going to pop. This is going to be a lot of fun here. Uh, what's coming up on the game? Sponsored by Golden State Lumber. Serving the Bay Area for three generations. When you succeed, we succeed. Visit GoToStateLumber.com. We'll get right back out to the lines. Christian McCaffrey is a 49er, and we're talking about it all day long here at 95.7 The Game. Hey, it's JP with the Golden State Warriors. Bull drives, gets down the lane, and dumped it down with a right hand. It's game day, Dub Nation. Jordan Poole right now getting wherever he wants to go on the floor. Taylor Jenkins has to call a timeout. Lock in all day right here on 95.7 The Game. Score big with Xfinity Internet. It's made to do anything, so you can do anything. Supercharge your home with the game-changing speed of supersonic Wi-Fi. With three times more bandwidth, it covers the field and then some. And blocks billions of threats with advanced security that helps keep you protected at home and on the go. If you're keeping score, that's Internet that does it all. That's unbeatable Internet from Xfinity. Learn more at Xfinity.com. Restrictions apply. Not available in all areas. Are you curious about who offers the best deals on top-rated Samsung, LG, and Sony TVs? The answer is surprising. It's not online, and it's not the warehouse clubs. The best deals on top-rated TVs are at video only. Don't believe it? Then check out the trade-in deals at video only. How about $500 for your old TV? Try doing that online. Before you buy that new TV, drop into video only. If you don't, you'll be sorry. Diabetes, high blood pressure, anxiety meds, everyone's on them. If you're a 50-year-old male, maybe a bit porky, and you may even have type 2 diabetes, a million dollars of term insurance may only cost you about 200 bucks a month. Call Term Provider. Speak with Big Lou at 800-200-1966. Big Lou will find a term life policy for you even if you have type 2 diabetes, are overweight, or have high blood pressure. 
term provider has helped thousands of people like you who think they can't afford term life insurance. To buy a million dollars of affordable term life for you, all you need to do is call Big Lou at 800-200-1966. Lou will make sure the scales are tipped in your favor. Call 800-200-1966. Big Lou will answer your call and work to fit you into a term life policy that you can afford. Remember, Big Lou's like you. He's on meds, too. Call 800-200-1966. 800-200-1966. Uncle, Kate's going to leave me, and I need your advice. What's the problem, John? She thinks I'm cheating on her, but I'm not. It's just that I have ED now, and I don't know why. Don't worry. The same thing happened to me. All men lose testosterone with age, and this can cause ED. I went to Balanced Medical Solutions, and they helped me rebalance my hormones. Now your aunt is happy again, and I lost weight, too. Ah, <sighs> Thank you. I'm going to call them today. Guys. Stop suffering. Call Balanced Medical Solutions now at 510-679-3300 or visit balancedmedicalsolutions.com. Bay Area, join us at our newest location, Afici, part of the Alexander Steakhouse Group. Afici features contemporary American cuisine in a fine dining setting. The multiple course menu showcases Italian and French style cuisine while highlighting locally sourced seasonal ingredients alongside some of the best products from around the globe. Whether you choose Afici for a special occasion, holiday events, or a culinary adventure, Afici provides unparalleled service. Head over to 680 Folsom Street, San Francisco for a fine dining experience. Reserve your seats now on AfficiSF.com. Venture X from Capital One is the travel card for people always asking, Where next? You earn 10x miles on hotels and rental cars and 5x miles on flights booked through Capital One Travel and 